Welcome back to another episode of Slow Life Trading. This is Robin here, and I'm walking with my daughter. She, uh, you know, usually I walk by myself, but then I walk with my daughter, and she just spent uh, a week here. This is her last day uh, here, and I want you guys to get a perspective of someone who only been out of the country, the United States, once, and that was on a cruise. And this time, she flew here with a friend, and uh, she stayed with me for a week. A friend had to leave early, wasn't feeling well, went back home. So I got to spend the last three, three days? Uh, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, like three, four. Three, four days with her, just me and her, and my daughter, and my wife. But my wife, oh man, she's a wonderful lady. She let me spend a lot of one-on-one -on -one time with my daughter, just me and her. So anyway, we're gonna get a perspective of, uh, you know, what she feels like. So Lexus, her name is Alexis. So Alexis. <laughs> What do what, I think? What do you think? Just give me your overall bra. What do you think about being here? It looks different. Uh, uh, let's get over here so okay. we can get out of this shade. I tell you what, let's walk around this block up here. Yeah. And make sure you get close to me so you can get in this camera. Gotcha. Okay. So, it's a different country, that's for sure. <laughs> okay, yeah. Um, so what makes it feel like it's a different country? It looks different. The buildings look different. Uh-huh. Um, the way people move around is different. Uh huh. Um, the culture is different. Okay. Everything's different. It looks different. It feels different. Even the streets, you know. Yeah. Um, and they drive a little crazy here, so I know I'm not in America. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, uh, other than the drive, okay, what's different about the buildings? They're all made of like they all are square. Yeah, that's They're true. They're all square, and then. No, no high rises. Uh, very few high rises. Very if they are, very, they're downtown. And then they're now, not that tall. Downtown is not tall. You have to go uh, to the north, and you'll see something. You may see one or two buildings about ten feet, ten stories. I mean, that's about it, though. Yeah, that's about it. You're not gonna it. see no skyscrapers. You're not gonna see no. So that was different. And now a lot of people travel on bike and by the um, mopeds. I hope yes, I'm yeah, right. mopeds, motorcycles, motorcycles. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of people. True. And then it's like three or four people on one. <laughs> yes, yes, that's true. So, um, uh, what do you think about the food? The food is good. The okay. food is good. Okay. I I like Mexican food. Okay. Now this is very authentic, real Mex Mexican food. food so it ain't. Camera. It is not Tex-Mex. No, it's not Tex-Mex. It's not Tex-Mex. It's not California Mex. <laughs> it's it's uh it's Mexican, authentic Mexican. Yeah. And you know here, they say that different parts of the country have different tastes for the food. I don't know if we could taste that difference, you know, to us it's all Mexican food, but uh, a lot of people say you can, and I guess when we start to travel, me and the wife, around the country, we'll, we'll uh, this country, we will uh, see the difference, but for now, it just seems like it's all Mexican food to me yeah. too. Uh, okay, what do you think about, uh, I'm trying to think. Well, I landed with no expectations. Okay. I landed with no expectations. And did I expect it to look like this? No, I didn't know what I expected, but I didn't expect this. You didn't, huh? Uh -uh. What, uh uh You don't know what you expected? I didn't have any expectations. Okay, even with your no expectation, did it exceed or disappoint your expectation? Your none expectation? Exceed. It exceeded? It exceeded it. Okay. It exceeded it because I feel like when I first landed, it's kind of like a shock, like, whoa, you know? Uh-huh. Because it's not Dallas, you know what I mean? Okay, it's okay. Dallas is a very clean city. Yeah, and not not in modern. In modern. Yeah. And this is like very historic. Yes. And like it's older. Yeah. You know? And so um I think that the way it looked was the most shocking for me when I landed. But um Now would you say it's bad? Well, does it look bad? Yeah. Is it just bad? I is mean, it just bad? Yeah. No, it's not all bad. Okay, okay. It's not all bad. It's just different. It's just different. I don't want to call it bad. No, it's not bad. It's not bad. It's just different. I don't want to call it bad because no. I feel like that would be the American in me. Yeah, exactly. You know? you. It would be. It's not It would it's be because it's not bad. It's not bad. It's but, just different. Yeah, it's just different. And yeah. people people are living over here just like we're living over there. It's, I, one of the things that shocks me is when I say, when I look at it and say, man, 
this is another society, modern society. This is a society. whole other society. And they're thriving and just like we are over this there. This is a whole other society. Yeah. And they're thriving too, and I thought that was really cool. They're thriving, and you know mm -hmm. they're thriving by going to the mall. By the, and the malls are super nice. The malls are super nice. And they super you nice. went to two of them, mm -hmm. but I know of really three or four really nice ones. Mm -hmm. And there's more than that. And they're the most newer. They're the mm -hmm. newest. Mm -hmm. They have some that are old, and they still look nice. It's a nice so, moss. And they have all of the stores, not all of them. A lot of the but stores that we I'm have. I'm going to say 80% of the same stores that we have in the U.S. I think I was really, well, I know like with the family group, you know, I knew they had American stores, but like uh -huh. they have way more than what I thought. Like they had uh, Costco. I didn't know they had Costco. Costco, Sam's, Sam's Walmart, uh, Walmart, Walmart Express, Home Depot, Home Depot uh, Burger King, Burger Carl's King, Junior, McDonald's, Starbucks. Starbucks. Uh, yeah. Oh, they have it. Uh, they have it. And uh, so, it's they, different. It's it's it's, it's kind of amazing. It's it's a sight to see. I will say that. I tell you what, a lot of people say that you know Mexicans are leaving Mexico to come to the United States, but what they don't realize is a lot of them <laughs> wish they could come back. You come back here. here. Yeah, because the only reason why they're leaving is they probably live in some of the bad parts of the country, or yeah, or they uh trying to go over there to make more dollars mm -hmm. but a lot of times when they retire they want to come back home yeah they do and i can't blame them i would uh, want to go back home too because it's home yeah because it's home yeah that's wherever you that know. may be yeah that's what you know yeah so uh anyway i just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a perspective of what someone coming from the u.s uh would think about living here and uh of course, you know I enjoyed it. I tried to show her as much as I possibly could in a we week's a time. Lot. We did a lot. <laughs> and we went from 8 in the morning to 9 o'clock at night. Okay, 12 for hours like and more. Three or four days. For like three days. Not straight, but over the trip. But over the trip, <laughs> yeah. But almost straight. Almost straight. Yeah. But anyway, we'll talk about this. If you have questions, put them down at the bottom. And uh, until the next time, peace out and keep it slow <laughs> one other thing i wanted to say was uh <clears throat> make sure you follow my daughter she has her she's a youtuber as well and instagram <laughs> and all that and hey you tell them okay so i do interviews i am an MC. i'm a host uh i dabble in djing and photography but you can check out my interviews at lex in a box on all platforms so that's youtube uh instagram facebook all that <laughs> yeah and we'll put the link either somewhere either down here or mm -hmm. up here something like that yep. so they can be sure to follow you yay again then, yeah go ahead ask me who i interviewed <laughs> ask, yeah who all have you interviewed uh erica banks bobby sessions claudia jordan just to name a few you'll check, check go to her link go to her website youtube and check it out she got her own channel lex in the box okay hey until next time guys we said this before but until next time Peace out. Peace out and keep it slow.